I like to manufacture a feeling of being at home for the houses I show. I want my clients to say, this is where my kids will grow up to break their first leg. This is where my wife will throw Tupperware parties. My daughter to pop her first sit in this bathroom. And Polly makes it all happen. Some people make fun of her, but really she's great. You walk into a room and you see her, you just know. This is home. I take her everywhere with me, even to my house. I take her on walks, and we eat. I even take her to the bathroom. That's not weird, is it? I mean, I've had her since I was a kid. I can't imagine what life would be like without her. Polly just understands me. She's special to me. Called Sissy? Yep. She's gonna cater for the open house. Okay. My boss and his wife. They came to my open house today. We'll uh, have a set up just over here. It didn't go so great. Ma'am, if I could please not have you touch. If I could have you not touch the display. <laughs> May have to do six weeks of therapy or I lose my job. I hope I pass. My boss, he was kind of mean. I wish I had a stuck up to him. I wish I could be brave and say, Hey man, you know, a flannel shirt would look great with that attitude. My name is Charlie Waters. Um, uh, this is a little bit unorthodox. I don't I'm not used to working with cameras. Um, normally these sessions are confidential, but um, I'm gonna make an exception. Uh, I've treated many clients with similar ailments before, and um, I yeah, um, I have a 100% success rate. I have a 100% success rate. At this point in my career, I could have helped Moses overcome his fear of public speaking. Ash is a sweet guy and I want to help him, which is why I'm willing to try something a little unorthodox this time. You and your cameras are inspiring me. It's been weird talking to Charlie. I've never felt so comfortable with a person before. It's like how I imagined home would feel. That's only the first session. I invited Charlie to my open house. I think she's going to come. As, as my therapist, of course. She said something about substitution therapy? I'm going to have him carry around a stalk of cauliflower. I wanted to see how meaningless Polly is. She's not real and he needs to understand that. Where have you been? You're late. I'm sorry, I'm really... Don't worry about it, just put it over here. Quickly. Excuse me, uh, is there an attic in this house? We have a baby on the way and we're looking to make a nursery. We're very excited, it's yeah. our first and it's we just a... want to get started. We've got twins actually on the way. We're, we're very excited. That's a nice cauliflower. <laughs> Take it. Yes, so where are you going? Look, I, uh... Substitute thing... For whatever the cauliflower... Mm -hmm. It's not working. What? I need Polly. No, listen to me, Ashley. You don't need her, okay? Remember, she's not real. You can do this. I'm right here. Let's just go back inside now, okay? Polly's gone. I... I don't know where she went. I mean, where could she go? I've lost my job. 
I don't think Charlie's gonna talk to me anymore. I don't know what's worse. Losing Polly or losing something more. I didn't make an appointment. I just really needed I just really wanted to see you. Don't, don't move. I have to see my boss, but I'll be right back. I'm really glad you came, Ashley. she meant to me. You have to understand, she's not real. She was never real. She, she can't love you. She's not real. Polly would never have done that. Polly would have, she, she would have Polly wouldn't have done anything. <laughs> she was never real. She can't love me. She can't love me. Got your note. Listen, I want to apologize about yesterday. That was super unprofessional. I should never get involved. I threw off a bridge. Wait, what? Who? Polly. Look, you were right about everything. She was never real. Nothing about my life has been real. Except you. But it's crossed my Home. head. It starts here. I long to comfort you next time you cry. I don't wish sadness on you, but I hope someday I might. We'll be two skinny lovers. Clogging up the streets Oh, they will stare and gossip But they don't know like we And the steel birds you've talked about Well, she's coming round the town